Hello everyone. Welcome to Coin Masters. I am Harshita Alveli. So today we have Anil with us who is from Maharashtra and he got placed in Cognizant recently. So he is here to share his experience with us. Let's talk to him and know about his interview experience with Cognizant. So hi Anil. Hello ma'am. How are you? Uh, good ma'am. How about you? I'm good too Anil. So firstly I would like to congratulate you for getting placed in uh, uh, Cognizant uh, Anil. We are very happy for you. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you so much. Okay, so before talking about anything else, could you tell more about yourself, Anil? I am Anil Virasdar. Uh, I am from Latu, Maharashtra. Mm -hmm. And uh, I am currently pursuing my 8th semester uh, at uh, HGGS Nandit. Uh, and okay. uh, I have got uh, placed in Cognizant for Gen C Elevate role for package of 4.25 LPA. Okay, so which branch do you belong to, Anil? I am from Information Technology. You have nice. Okay, super, super. So, was this an off-campus or an on-campus interview? It was an on-campus one. It was on-campus. So, when did you yeah. get to know that Cognizant is coming to your college? Uh, I got to know uh, in uh, 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 September, ma'am. September. First, uh, we, our TPO informed mm -hmm. about that. Uh, okay. On, uh, yeah. First, uh, we have... Uh, uh, what uh, submit our resume and all the details on superset and uh, mm -hmm. in september our dp informed about the uh, cognizant is coming on on campus okay. and uh, on 11 uh, i got a uh, uh, mail for a uh, test uh, it was a uh, on, only uh, skill based test man there was no aptitude questions in that uh, so when was the first round conducted on 11 September. On 11 September 2021, the first round was conducted. Yes, ma'am. Okay, tell about everything in detail, Anil. Tell us about the first round. Uh, it was a uh, one hour 40 minute test. One hour 40 it, minutes test. Yes, there were uh, four coding questions and 15 mm -hmm. uh, MCQ, uh, which are uh, only from technical. It means uh, there were DSA question, uh, SQL question, and uh, some uh, questions from Java, C, and C++ also. Okay, so it was purely technical, nothing uh, aptitude yes. was asked. No, no, no. So no. do you remember what those four coding questions were? I am not exactly uh, remembering, but uh, okay. uh, it was uh, two, two questions are from uh, programming, means logical based, means we have mm -hmm. to, there were, uh, there was a scenario, and uh, from the scenario, we, we have to solve some problem. Okay. And uh, uh, we can choose uh, any language, Java, C, C++, okay. uh, we have choices there. And two questions are from SQL. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, I could uh, do uh, two uh, logical questions, that programming question, and uh, in which uh, I could uh, do only one optimized, and one was okay. uh, like basic, uh, I, I could do. And mm -hmm. SQL, I done uh, two of them. Okay, so other than these four coding questions, you had 15 MCQs, right? Yes, sir, 15 MCQs. Okay, what well, those MCQs were from which concepts? Uh, DSA, data structures and algorithm, uh, okay. C, C language, uh, Java, and C++. So and also, what was the level of these questions? These are basic questions, ma'am. You could answer easily. Uh -huh. But uh, the, uh, about that four questions, uh, you have some good uh, knowledge about programming and uh, DS. Oh, okay, fine. Then, so yeah, when did you get to know the results of this round? Uh, I get to know about on 16 September. 16. Oh, okay, just after five days, you got to know that you are shortlisted for the next round. Yes, ma'am. And then, when did when was the next round conducted? The second round. On 29 uh, September, uh, my uh, technical round is conducted. Okay, so what was the second round? Uh, in which uh, uh, interview asked me to introduce myself. I introduced myself. So that was a then... technical round or an HR round? Anil? It was technical, technical round, purely okay. technical. Round. Yeah, please go ahead. Tell, other, tell us about it. Uh, HR uh, introduced uh, uh, himself and uh, asked me to uh, introduce myself. And uh, I introduced myself. Then he directly uh, asked me uh, two programming questions. One was... Uh, 
pure programming question like he asked me to uh, count the frequency of characters from an inputted string mm -hmm. and uh, second question from sql it was like a uh, uh, count uh, no, no uh, it was uh, find a uh, um, second max uh, salary from the uh, ta uh, employee table okay i could do uh, two of them you could uh, do both of it okay very nice yes. and then what else was asked this is it ma'am then That's we stop uh, yes ma'am it was only 15 minute uh, interval, so you just asked to write the code for two questions and nothing else was asked no 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 okay fine so this happened on 29 september and when did you get to know that you are shortlisted for the next term on 2nd october ma'am 2nd october you got the results and when was the next term conducted was that the last yeah, yeah, term? No, the, the again the one round was conducted. That is HR round. It was just formality. Uh, okay. In which uh, uh, HR only verified my documents. Uh, mm -hmm. She asked me to show pan card and the soft okay. copies of all my results from 10, 12th, and all semesters. Okay. So when what was the date on this day? I mean, when was this conducted? The last round, HR round. 2nd october 2nd october only okay yes. okay fine fine so that was very simple it was just a formality yes, nothing complicated was asked yes okay fine so when did you get to know the final results that you are placed uh, in competition? 10th october our tpo mailed us uh, about that uh, you have got selected for gen c elevator role okay so how many of you had applied do you have any rough figure like how many do you know how many uh, of you from our college, uh, uh, 200 students were uh, applicable, and from mm -hmm. which uh, uh, they selected one, 120 or 25 students. So many of you all got selected. 100 yes. plus students got selected. Yes, ma'am. Ma'am, ma the, there were uh, three roles: Gen C, Gen C Levet, and Gen C Next. Next. Okay. Uh, for Gen C, Gen C Next, only six. So around 60 percent of you all got selected for different roles. Yes. Yes. Yes, okay okay fine fine that's really nice and uh, yeah so do you have any tips or suggestions to your friends and juniors and which will help them get placed as well uh, for getting jobs in it you should be good at aptitude mm -hmm. it is basic and you should be good at aptitude uh, <laughs> there is no way for that and for getting a higher package role like developer role or software the programmer role you should be good at programming, one programming language and data structure and algorithm questions. You should be good at it. And uh, first of all, uh, the communication means uh, if you have good knowledge, but you can't express your knowledge, then it is not it's good. It's of no so, use. Uh, Having good communication skills is very important. Yes, uh, we should have average, means average communication, minimum, minimum requirement. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Fine, fine. So, since you're a student of Pan Masters, would you like to tell how was your journey with Pan Masters, Anil? Yes, uh, it was a very nice journey, ma'am. Because uh, uh, I am not good at aptitude. The human sir made me like good at aptitude, and uh, Shashank sir uh, was very good at programming. He is master of programming. Uh, and uh, I got uh, some more uh, our programming because, uh, from my uh, academics. I could could not complete uh, good to get to know that about that. So I I can I I was very uh, means poor at programming, but Shashank sir made me uh, good at programming. So it was good. Okay, thank you so much. Tha. We are very happy that we could help you, Anil. Uh, you could learn from the trainers and you also got placed. We are really happy for you. Thank you. And one last question, Anil. Would you recommend Quant Masters to your friends and juniors? Yes, ma'am. Definitely. It is a, a very uh, good uh, institute for learning aptitude and programming for placements. Thank you so much, Anil. And also, thanks for being here, sharing all the information with us, Anil. Students, so many students out there are trying really hard to get placed in Cognizant. Your experience will definitely help them. Thank you, ma'am. Congratulations once again and all the very best for your future. Thank you.